again, YouTube. I cut off the last video short because it was running late. Now it's time to meet Mr. Bear, oh, yeah. Kanji. Now that you mention it, I kind of remember this thing. Didn't think it was a bear, though. Hey, why is it a bear? I don't know. <laughs> Me neither. I've been wondering, too. It, it's kind of cute. M mind if I pet you? No touching allowed, mister! <laughs> Hey, don't give me any lip, Bear! <laughs> uh, by the way, I've, I've been wondering. You were kidnapped too, right, Yukiko-senpai? Huh? Yeah, it wasn't long before you. So, like, that means you came out to everyone too? Th that's uh... What was it like for Sim- <clears throat> Oh, sorry. I didn't mean to hit you so hard. Good job. <laughs> I'll be uh, more gentle next time. Next time. More gentle? Oh god. What a pair of dimwits. Oh yeah, here's a present from me, Kanji. It's to celebrate you joining the team. Ah, oh, so these are the glasses you guys told me about. Hurry and put them on. No, uh, she's so happy. Sure, but because she knows what on, it is. Are these different from everyone else's? On you. <laughs> Damn, dude, it looks great on you. I had a normal pair ready for you, but Yuki chan insisted on this one. She wouldn't budge. Yeah, real funny, you smart ass. Why are you taking it out on me? Give me that! <laughs> uh, there it is again. <laughs> you took my spare pair. Kanji, you must really like those. <laughs> And there it goes. This is the real one. It wasn't easy getting it to you. Why the hell did you bother making a spare if it's more useless crap? Damn it! I'll get you guys for this someday. You never will. <laughs> that laugh is why everyone should go Yukiko their first playthrough. You're back. I always do that. I always have to go home instead. What are you doing? All right. <laughs> Forward, defender. We don't have a striker, so I want to beef up our team strength there. Mostly a midfielder. When I was a kid, there was a position I player I liked who had that position. Do you know Karu Yamakazi Yamazaki? What kind of player was he? Yeah. He was an unpolished player, but he'd get a pass through no matter what it took. Well, he's from a manga, though. Well, I think he can handle any position. You have talent. Because said that, too, you know, that you're physically whatever. Oh. This is for you. Later. Careful on your way home. Hit the spot. 
You know, the rainy season's just about here. Isn't it a little early? Once it starts, it'll be raining every night. We'll have to keep a constant eye on the Midnight Channel. Nah. Crap, I didn't even think of that. Well, so it goes. <laughs> I thought you were worried about the rain because of the school camp out. Why are you so excited about that? That's right, it's the first time for you two. You realize the only purpose of the school camp out is to develop a love for one's hometown and young people, right? Yeah, they tell us that up front, so? Well, you see, the way we supposedly develop that love is by picking up trash off the mountain. Picking up trash? Develop a love my ass, that's slave labor! Well, the night's kind of fun. We cook our own meals with mess kits and sleep in tents. The four of us are in the same group. The same group, huh? Does that mean we sleep together at night, too? No. You <laughs> wish! Guys and girls sleep in different tents. I'm warning you. If you leave your tent at night, you'll be expelled on the spot. This gets worse and worse. I thought it was going to be fun. It's only for one night, and we disband before noon the next day. It doesn't last very long. Oh, we did have some fun at the river before going home last year. Do they let you go swimming? I think so. There's always someone who takes a dip, although we didn't. I see. So you can swim in the river. <sighs> Great. Uh, wait. Oh, I forgot this is today. Fine. No, thank me, jerkwad. I wanted to hang out with with Chie. I'm joining up today. I've been assigned to replace your member. Teacher, thank you. I know your sister. You know what? Sure, I'll clean up. Mm. 
Turn around, there you go. It's what now, 6 7? I'm not bothering with you, Nanako again. I'm still gonna spend time with Yosuke, but not yet. Hello! Spend time with the kitty cat! Meow 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 meow. Interacting with a cute little cat has calmed you and stood you with a sense of great gentleness. <laughs> That's right, Nanako chan! I'd rather give all my affection to a kitty cat than you! That's horrible. I never- I didn't mean it! I didn't mean it! of my people's things yet. Hey, guess what I just heard? When they're sitting in back of you, it's like a squeeze play! Who's sitting? A girl, obviously. Sorry, I got ahead of myself. Talking about how when there's a girl sitting behind you on a motorcycle, they press right up against your back. Man, you're a lot thicker than I thought. <laughs> anyway, I think motorcycles are the hot new thing for guys now. Girls like guys who spend time outdoors, right? So I got you this. Want to get your license with me, partner? Well, I can't afford anything bigger than a scooter on my budget, but at least that'll let us get to new places. Don't you think we deserve that much? Oh, the squeeze play plan. Sup, senpai? Hey, this was the camping trip. This was the plan I was talking about in an earlier video. You guys busy right now? Kinda. We're talking about motorcycles. Motorcycles? You gonna go stomp a gang? If you're bringing a war, I'll help. No, we're not bringing a war. What does that mean, anyway? We're just talking about getting motorcycle licenses. Licenses? You guys don't have yours? Huh? No way! Don't tell me you already... Nah, I'm still 15 and all. Then why'd you say it like that? Man, that reminds me. I'm surprised you picked a fight with that biker gang. Eh, the bike's all I need for that. In any case, we can't let you in on our up-close-and-personal plan. Up-close-and-personal? What does that mean? Keep it down! Like I was telling this guy, what a guy needs nowadays to be a big man is first, a motorcycle. And then... And then... A girlfriend. Tell me more. Now that's my partner. All right then. You guys gonna get licensed for the big stuff? I mean, I know I came in late here, but if you're talking about taking a girl on a bike, you gotta be seating too, man. That ain't allowed on a scooter. I 
forgot about that. Shut up, this'll work out. As long as we have a motorcycle, the girls will come running. That's all the advantage we'll need. Hey. Now listen carefully. The reason we don't have girlfriends is because we're stuck here in this town waiting to meet someone. This place is so tiny, it's no wonder we can't find one. It doesn't matter if it's only a scooter. Some kind of motorcycle is just the ticket for us to get some chicks. Then, later on, we can get a bigger motorcycle. And that's when the up close and personal plan really starts. Up close and personal? Plus, you know, you and me have more of a city boy thing going on. If we're serious about this, we've got to expand our horizons to a bigger town. We gotta to take the initiative. There's no time to wait for a train that only leaves every so often each day. We'll roar up on our motorcycles like the badasses we are, and when the chicks come up, we'll play it cool. The pheromones dripping off of us will bring them around in no time. We're fe feral zone? No, we're not going to a cat house, you idiot. My research shows that a motorcycle is the number one surefire way to increase a man's pheromones. Pheromones? <laughs> Don't say it like that, man. Jesus. Dude, that's how a perv would react. What did you say? Fine, then I'm in too. Get ready for Kanji Tatsumi to show his manhood to these chicks. I only told you, <laughs> I love you the can't. girls looking over. Anyway, don't tell anyone about this. When he says if that. If other guys try to copy us, it'll end up diluting our pheromones. So, partner, make sure you talk to your uncle about getting a license, okay? Got it. Not you. I don't even know your uncle. I'm serious about this. If we have motorcycles, we can go all over. It'll be fun! Man, somewhere out there, the best days of our youth are ahead of us. Yeah, I'm with you on that one. Jeez, that scene took forever. Can't really report to the fox. There's not been a day where I can just sit back and do whatever. Uh. Man. I kind of want to get Chie as my girlfriend by the end of... But before the camping trip. I don't know if that will matter for anything. Yeah, just give her the things. I don't even care about showing off what happens. If it weren't for that one day where I kind of screwed up the order of things, I could have ended up just going, getting GA as my girlfriend already. Brightest building. Eh. Eh. Senpai! Later, sir. I forgot two F. Up. Get the other quest. Have you ever decided to give you a plastic model? Not really.
I'll let you know. Alright, so she's taken care of. There's really nothing else to do today. Because you can't talk to Chie. I could go into the TV. I can't talk to the fox yet because... I'm an idiot and there's too much... Too many, um... Too many things going on in-game. Shut up, Ian. <coughs> I almost spoiled things. Uh, no, listen to me, I'm stupid. It's apparently not the magic cross I need to give it. No, I want to get the... to do Nice Hey Dojima, can I get a motorcycle motorcycle? I just want to ride my ah, motorcycle. You're back. Sickle. Come on. Hi there. You want some meal too? Fair warning, it's from the supermarket. Well, excuse me. It's delicious, though. I can't believe it was on sale. Sorry, but this guy eats instant noodles every day. That constant slurping got on my nerves, so I called him here. You don't have to bluff like that. You just wanted to eat dinner with a coworker, right? Don't be stupid. But eel was a great choice. Nanako chan loved it at least. I'd say she's eerily proud of her daddy. Huh? Huh? <laughs> Shut up, Adachi. Did my joke slip away? It is an eel, after all. Oh, I'm gonna hate hanging out with you, I bet. <laughs> Just eat your dinner. E yes, sir. Nanako chan's such a good girl, though. She went straight to do her homework once her plate was clean. It's not every day you get to eat eel. You'd think she would have spent some more time savoring it. You think that because you slack off too much. You should follow her example. <clears throat> Way to hit where it hurts. Say, I want to get a motorcycle license. What's the matter? A motorcycle? You mean a scooter? Oh, that's right. Kids your age can ride those. Uh, I don't know, though. Come on, don't be a spoil sport. It's no surprise he wants one out here. I understand how you feel since I'm from the city myself. The trains don't run that often, and walking around everywhere is pretty inconvenient, isn't it? Yeah, it's a hassle. Right? It's criminal. You say that, but... That reminds me, I remember you telling me something once, Dojima-san, about some of the reckless things you did on your motorcycle when you were young. You moron. Think before you talk. And once you're done eating, hurry and... Beep, 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 beep. Ugh. me? Hmm. Alright. We'll be there soon. Looks like... Adachi, you were the one in charge of that file, right? File? Oh, did that suspicious guy show up again? Would you keep your mouth shut? We're going back. Get in the car. Back? You mean to the station? But I haven't had my eel liver soup yet. About this license, did you decide on this yourself? N no one talked you into it? 
There was definitely no plans for girls' boobs on my back. Not two wheeled vehicles can be dangerous. Do you understand? I'll be careful with it. I'm sure I can trust you to do that. But allowing you to get one is another thing. Don't give me that face. I know you're serious about this. First, you need a license. We can talk about this again when you have one. Well then, sorry to dump this on you, but I need you to look after the house. Gotcha. Eh? Yo, it's me. How did it go with your uncle? It went great. Seriously? Then let's go get ours as soon as we can. I gotta hit the books. Let's make sure we both pass together. <laughs>